You are welcome to class. Today we are going to be seeing how to write large and small numbers in standard form. So when we say a number is in standard form, it means it's a number of the form a times 10 raised to the power n. The a there is a number in between 1 and 10, Y n can be a negative or a positive number, and n cannot be a fraction. So let's see the first example, how to write the large number in standard form. So write 234,000 in standard form. So let's see how to do that. So first we write the number 234,000 equals to 2 point. So the point will always come immediately after the first digit. So why is it 10 raised to the power 5? Because the decimal point is going to move 5 places to the left starting from the last digit here which is 0 so 1 2 3 4 5 so that's why it is 10 raised to the power 5 let's see another example express 456.8 in standard form so first we write the number 456.8 is the same thing as 4.568 times 10 raised to the power 2 so also the decimal point move two places to the left. So let's see example three now. Write 0 0.0000032 in standard form. This is a number less than one. So we are going to see how to do that. So it will be 3.2 times 10 raised to power. Now because it is a number less than one, we are going to have minus whatsoever power. So it will be minus 6. Okay, let's see another example. Evaluate 7.5 times 10 raised to the power 3 times 34.2 times 10 raised to the power 2. So how are we going to do that? We will multiply the whole part first, which is 7.5 times 34.2. Then we also multiply the one that is in form of index 10 raised to the power 3 times 10 raised to the power 2. So if we multiply that first two numbers, we get 256.5. Now 10 raised to the power 3 times 10 raised to the power 2 is the same thing as 10 raised to the power 5. Okay, we change the first one to standard form. It is 2.565 times 10 raised to the power 2. Then times, we have our 10 raised to the power 5 there. And when we multiply 10 raised to the power 2 times 10 raised to the power 5, we get 10 raised to the power 7. So the number is now in standard form. So assessment question right there. So go over the video. To make sure you get better understanding, then come and solve the assessment questions. Thank you.